there that I grew I went to high school with out here. I connected with him. He said, he said, oh, I gotta celebrate Ramadan this month. I said, I can't hang out with you. I said, okay. I said, I started to touch in a little bit on him. You know, I'm telling him, I'm telling him who, who Ishmael really is. You know, I'm gonna take him to Genesis 17 chapter, or is it, no, no, is it 17 chapter? I think it's Genesis 1. You talking about he was a wild man? No, no. Yeah, she's worth it's the prophecy that God gave for Abraham. Abraham. And then he told Abraham, he says, he says, I will give you a son by your wife Sarah. You know, and my covenant will be with him. He said, as for Ishmael, he said, I will bless him, I will make him a great nation, but my covenant will be with Isaac, yeah. which you will have by your wife Sarah a year from now. You know, I think that's how I feel. Yeah, it's no got his little blessing with his little caliphates and stuff. 17 and 20, yeah, exactly. 17 and 20. Uh, yeah, and the cal you know when the Muslim Empire formed, that was his little blessing. Look how large they are. Yeah, they big, they giant. They're giant. And, and that's why they're radicals too. That's why they're blowing up everything. These terrorists, the Muslim terrorists, that's what that is. You know? But man, they turn their back on them. They, you know, they start praying away from him. You know? Or uh, just away from the most high. Yeah, but that Muslim stuff, though, that was all. Like, you know about the Kaaba stone, right? The Kaaba stone, that's what I'm talking about. Yeah, like, they was worshiping that's in that pre-Muhammad. Like, that had been there way before Muhammad was there. And then he incorporated all that paganism into his new... You know, this go to Deuteronomy 28. They said Muhammadism was pre-Muhammad. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. They just make up shit. 28 go to 64. They just make up shit. 28 64. He got all that from the Israelites. Well, it's all, it was politically motivated. Uh, yeah. The whole thing with Israel. Well, that's yeah. why they call it the Most High, Allah. Mm -hmm. That just means God. You know? Yeah. Power. Yeah. 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 Power. Yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah. uh, yeah. yeah. uh, yeah. Deuteronomy 64. Yahweh yeah, shall scatter thee among all people from the one end of the earth even unto the other. And there thou shalt serve other gods which neither thou nor thy fathers have known even a wood and stone. Wood and stone. That wood is the cross. Christianity. Oh, yeah. And the stone. That's pegging right there. Like Kabbalah stone you're talking yeah, about. Yeah, that, that meteorite. Right. <laughs> right. <laughs> that's what it is. <laughs> they do. That's, that mean, it's a meteorite. Right? It's just like the one in the, uh, the, what is that, the book of Acts. What was that, like the 19th? When they were talking about the image of Diana that fell from the sky. Oh, yeah. yeah that was yeah. a meteorite, too. That was a meteorite, too, right. Yeah. You know, I've been watching, I'm going to tell y'all something. There's some type of connection here. I've been watching these down with, with my third eye open, with, with the truth, yeah. under, with the understanding of the truth, right? Well, I'm looking at these things, because you can still learn from looking at these TV, because you're going to tell you can see how the devil's trying to deceive people. Oh, yeah. People. You follow what I'm saying? So I watched this, an, an, oh, it's called an Ancient Alien. Oh, alien. yeah, we yeah. you know about series. that. I watched them series, and they talk about Israel a lot. Yeah. And they talk about, uh, they got one, they're talking about the, uh, about the Ark of the Covenant. Yeah. And they talked about it was a box. It's a, a electronic device brought oh, yeah. down by aliens. <laughs> Did they say that? Hey, man, the Ark of the Covenant is crazy, though. It's crazy. Because yeah. they thought it had power. The box is so It got some power. kind of power in there. Yeah. It, it was they said the most high there. would appear on top of the mercy seat. That's, that's what they said. You know what yeah. and, and it's funny. Well, I, I know this is, I, that's in the Bible. I, I ain't seen that episode, though. Yeah, that episode. Also, Watch that episode. Yeah. They also said that uh, they used some kind of music to tear down the wall of Jericho. Yeah, the Jericho. Yeah, know that? <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. It's kind that's of machinery. Right, right. With right. right. the music? Yeah. Seven days. They no, the Israelites did march around and they blew seven the trumpets. Right. Right. Yeah, they blew the trumpets. Yeah, right. yeah. the walls came falling down. Right. Yeah. 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 Powerful stuff. That's powerful stuff. That's yeah. really yeah. Well, this sound right here, uh, we, we making vibrations with our, and this affects people. Same with our vibrations. Same yeah, thing. exactly. We're tearing down the, the, yeah. the country. Yeah, yeah, this, yeah. We're blowing the trumpet out here. That's it. That's it. That's it. You know? Same as that thing. They don't really understand it. As long as Israel was within their law, was following the law, statutes, and commandments, that they was on high. They had power above all nations on this earth. You know, so they found a way to break us down, right? So that's why they, they, they make sure you don't get back together. That's why it's so big a thing about not following the laws. That's why it's such a big thing. And I tear them down every time somebody, when the Christians start to come here, I give them. Right to Matthew 5, 17, 18, and 19. Read that. They ain't trying to hear that one. Isaiah 55 said, Let the wicked forsake his way, and the unrighteous man his thoughts, and let him return unto the Lord, and he will have mercy and prudence and strong power. For he will abundantly part. For my thoughts are not your thoughts, Neither of all your ways, my ways, my my ways, ways says the Lord. For as the heavens are higher than the earth, so are my ways higher than your ways, your ways. 
and my thoughts in your thoughts. For as the rain cometh down and the snow comes from heaven and returneth not thither, but where the earth and make it bring forth the blood, that it might give seed to the sower and bread to the eater, so shall my word be that goeth forth out of my mouth. It shall not return unto the Lord. Oh, yeah, like what right. saying, right. by the pushing his word, we're actually destroying the physical. The physical, right. You know, so, you know it's, it's parallel. The, 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 it's right. it's spiritual. It's spiritual. control the physical. Yeah. They're parallel. That's right. That's right. Yeah. 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 You know, some brothers, they lose faith. They think they're not having an effect. You know, they think, oh, ain't nobody listening to me. Somebody's listening. Yeah. 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 It don't yeah. ever go out. The word don't go out in vain. It yeah. don't. Yeah. Yeah. It's a tower. Here you go. But it shall accomplish that which I please, and it shall prosper in the things where to I sent it. Right. And that's when you can go to uh, Amos 9 and 8. The eyes of the Lord are upon the sinful kingdom. And what he say? I will destroy it from off the face of the earth. Start right. with the word. Right. Yeah, this place is already destroyed, man. We're I got to get back to It's just playing out, man. These people off. like these, man, right. these are rich people. I wish. <laughs> you got money, man. Hey, yo, you got money. All right, brother. Just hit us up, you know. Yep, I got his number. They got All right. Money. Yeah, they got money, man. They got money, man. They got money, man. They got money, man. He's like, I wish. He means they want their ball shot, man. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. They yeah. wish they had that. But right, right now, man, they make us look stupid. What's up, sister? What's up, man? How do you do? Football. Oh, okay. Football. Thank you. Yeah, I played the real. Oh, the hell of football. That's how he can take that. That's a crazy sport. That's how I wipe me out with that. I play some basketball. Football taking it too far. Time. <laughs> hey, I'd rather take a chance in football. Huh? What? Because jumping, man. How many times I've been twisting my ankle, come down with somebody's foot, man? I don't like that. I don't like that at all. Yeah. Hey, you heard about that dude. I think he was the Senator of Congress. But he openly admitted that. I got it downloaded on my tablet. Oh, yeah. That's, and, they, and they pushing that hard now, man. That's, really that's why they got it. It's called, now it was the LGBT. Now it's LGBTQ. But now it's LGBTQP. Oh, Dang. <laughs> and it's real, man. We make it real. Nor are we exaggerating. Right. That's the world we're doing. I mean, that, why else are we going to come and destroy One of them protesters had a sign. I don't know about this one. But I've seen a sign where a protester held and it said LGBTQ. Here? No, nah, it wasn't here. It was, a, it was a gay protest, though. Even 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 in that, in that high school, they did some back in Oh, yeah. Lean on me. Yeah, lean on me. That's the best movie, bro. Yeah. Hey, that's the school I went to, bro. My school was just like that school. Yeah, man, I was hoping to get the fuck out of here with interrupting it. He don't have understanding, first of all. He think he does. He don't have understanding. Wow. He's fake. Like you said, he's doing the work, moving around. He's following, following, he following, following a car, man. Go straight up. Straight up. That ain't said he worked a car. A car? A car. A car. A car. A car with GOCC. I am oh, watching the shine. Right oh, yeah, he's talking about the bug out. Right yeah, the bug out. Yeah. Bu Bubble like Black Panther? I don't know. That's the Disney musical star. You hear what I'm saying? Oh, yeah. Yeah, like yeah. a little concert. He, he sounded like a song out of Little Mermaid or something, bro. A part of this world. <laughs> I remember when we first hit the first one. I was like, whoa, bro. Yeah, that's what's called for, whoa. At least they get the market of beast right. I give them credit on that one. That's about all they get. Yeah, they, they just like, Oh, that's the spirit. I, the spirit had me say you how it. See? That's the spirit. <laughs> yeah, they call me uh, Yahaya and Ashaya. Yeah, 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 good idea. I am, I am. They, they, they call it. But people don't understand when they say I am, they talking about themselves. Right. They ain't talking about the Mukha. Ahaya means I am. Yahaya means he is, he exists. They talking about him. They trying to say, that's just, yeah, that's all backwards. That's just, look at that noise. They still protesting? They coming back? Yeah, they still protesting. I'm surprised.
I got a, I got a scripture real quick to prove that the Most High's name is Yahweh, not a Uh Since, since we on that, since we mentioned it, I gotta prove it. Uh, man, where the hell am I going? Psalms? Ain't that Psalm 103? I think it's Psalm 103. No, Psalms 113. Wait till you Exodus 3, I think. Yeah, excellent, right, excellent. Excellent. Come on, boss, come section, dude. He talked about I am. Yeah, my brain is frozen. Uh, 83. Good lord, bro. I got the three in my brain. You know, sometimes the way my numbers is working in my brain. All right, so I'm going to All right, all right. Salawam. Uh, all right, here we go. Yes, Psalms 83 and 18. That men may know that thou whose name alone is Yahweh are the most high over all the earth. But in English says Jehovah. But we know we know that's not correct. Right, ain't no J in Hebrew, so it's really pronounced Yahweh. Okay, a lot of people say Yahweh. Or uh, Yahuwah. Even the Native American Indians call the Most High Yahweh. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. What's that stone called? The Los Los Lone Stone. And also uh, the North uh, the American Indian by James the Beard. He said that they called the Most High Yahweh. Right. There's out. I think it's Kashaka, Ohio, just uh, 30 miles east of uh, Newark. They got they found stones there also. Native Americans calling it. Hey, Newark? You're talking about here, right? Oh, uh, Yeah, yeah, yeah. East of Newark. Yeah, they found like a Ten Commandments tablet or something. I made a video. They found one of the ones. Now, the Kashaki. In Borough Cave in Illinois, they found one that they found back in the Hey, he saw Christ. Jesus loves you, this I know. Uh, Exodus 3, 14. <laughs> and God said unto Moses, I am that I am. And so 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 when the most high speak, he said I am, which is Ahia. But he intended me that's where they get it. It's like, oh see God, he said his name is Ahia. No. Continue. He said, Thus shalt thou say unto the children of Israel, I am have sent me unto you. Is the main point. God said unto Moses, or over, or over. Also. This is what you shall say to Israel. So this is what we got to teach to Israel. This is what we're supposed to teach. Go ahead. Yahweh, God of your fathers, the God of Abraham, the God of Isaac, and the God of Jacob, has sent me unto you. This is my name forever, and this is my memorial unto all generations. So he said his name was Yahweh. So, because when you, like the brother already said, when you say Ahia, you're saying I am talking about yourself. Well, so you don't, that's not how you say his name, because the Lord's name literally means he is. He's the all existing one. It really means he to be, actually, when you really when you directly translate into English, it means he to be. He is everything. The most high is everything. So you don't say I'm everything. That's it's only a higher when the most high is talking about himself. But when we talk about him, it's he. It's Yahweh. Yah means he. Yah means he. Howard means to be. There's a whole lot of Jake niggas that got their eye on that mentality. Yeah. I mean, people can't get it, bro. But it it goes, it'll take a bubble eyed blackfish to go and mess up the most high name, bro. Y'all bugged out looking. Our eyes so big, they about to pop out his head and roll on the ground like some barbie. <laughs> The main point is at the end. But uh, this is uh, Hebrews 11 and 6. But well, without faith, it's impossible to please him. But he that comes to him, sorry, but he, he that comes to God must believe at the point that he is. 
Yeah, he is. Yeah, he is. Yeah, he is. That doesn't make no sense. I mean, it's grammar. Y'all gotta learn grammar. You know what I mean? It actually, what? Oh, go ahead. What's it called? Third person, second person. Yeah. If I'm speaking third person, I think that's like myself. Right? Well, when you're speaking a first, first person, yeah. first person is I am. Yeah. So when you talk to somebody, you don't say. Uh, I mean, this is retarded, bro. The second person is like talking to somebody like he is, and third person is like narrator, right? Now. Whatever. So we'll get the point right. is. You put what, talking to first person. You talking to first person. That's talking about yourself. Like I am. I am this. I am right, that. right. Like, like uh, when I was in boot camp, they made us call ourselves this recruit. We had to talk in the. Uh, yeah, yeah. So that's just dumb, bro. We wasn't allowed to say our. We was not allowed to say the word I. Because yeah, they was like, no, this is a I. Yeah, we was not allowed to say I. We said the word I. You get fucked up. We was not allowed to say that. I guess it's their ego. Now, ego means I, that means self, you know? All right, and while we at it, the, the son of the Most High's name is Yahweh Shai. The son, the father's name is Yahweh, the one y'all call God. His name ain't Lord, and his son's name ain't Sweet Jesus. The son's name in ancient Hebrew is Yahweh Shai, okay? And that means he saved, he delivered, okay? And the way you would say Jesus' name in English would be he saves, okay? Because his name in Hebrew literally means he saves or he delivers. You know? Go ahead. Malachi 3.16, then they that fear the Lord spake often one to another, and the Lord hearkened and heard it, and a book of remembrance was written before him for them that feared the Lord, and that thought upon his name. His name, I mean, you can, you can do a search on the name. There's so many scriptures to tell you that. So the scripture says what? What is that? Uh, what scripture is that you just read? Malachi 3.16. Oh, that's an easy one to remember. 3.16. There's a lot of scriptures in the Bible that get that 3.16 in it. There's some fire scriptures. Then 3.16, there's a lot of them. Galatians 3. Yeah, Galatians. Galatians. Uh, but what's that Romans? Oh, let me get it. I'm just going to get it. I'm just quoting everything. I got to get the scripture. I'll be quoting everything. What is that, Romans 12? What scripture is that? Uh, uh, that I'm, I got my scriptures all mixed up today. One second. Isn't that Romans 12? Whoever called the name of the Lord shall be saved. Sam? Oh, yeah, you're right, you're right. I don't know why I'm thinking 12. My brain is not. Yeah, I got it. Uh, Romans 10 and uh, 13. For Actually, no, let me read this. Romans thir uh, 10 and 13. For whosoever shall call upon the name of the Lord shall be saved. And actually, this is quoting... This is quoting something. Hold on a second. 1 Samuel 12 and 22. Let's get 1 Samuel 12 and 22. I got that precept Bible, boy. Give you that precept. What did I say? 1 Samuel 12 and 22? We got all them twos in it. I, I want to read it. 1 Samuel 12 and 22. Oh, what? Is this right? But the Lord will not forsake his people for his great name's sake, because it had pleased the Lord to make you his people. You see that? It said the Lord will not forsake his people for his great name's sake. Oh, that's another scripture to prove what? That you're not saved by your works. Because we get saved for the Lord's name's sake, because he said he was going to save us. I mean, we're supposed to try to be as righteous as you can, but that ain't going to save you. You ain't going to get saved because you kept the law perfect.
Yeah, it's all about. Like, uh, IUIC is out here. Uh, wow. IUIC was out here, and this brother right here asked him, he just, because they was running away from us. They didn't want to talk to us, but he asked him real quick. We got it on camera. He said, how do we get saved? And they said, by keeping the law. Wrong. So that's a fail. You got an F. <laughs> you fail. And then people don't get it. Like, you gonna say you don't have to keep the law? So y'all can't get it, bro. Galatians 2 and 16. Oh, let me get it. Galatians 2 and 16. Galatians 3 and 11. Galatians 2 and 11. They coming out with all the precepts. Like my body. My Bible's all wet. Which one you get? 2 and 16? All right. Galatians 2 and 16. Knowing that a man is not justified by the works of the law, but by the faith, by the faith of Yahweh Shai Mashiach, even we have believed in Yahweh Shai that we might be justified by the faith of the Mashiach or the Messiah, and not by the works of the law. For by the works of the law shall no flesh be justified. Woo, wow. How do you get around that one? That's that cut. That's that fire scripture. And you know why right. too? Because some people have fun with these and all. Like I said, Dayton Man, Battle Nine, you are seeing a couple of things, right? And some people they like to boast in the law. You know, they're like, oh, I keep the law better than you. Right. Com comparing them to, to you and you know. That's, that's and that's look, and they know that we poor shit. They don't talk to me at all unless I'm on the phone and everything now. They know that they know that shit because they not stupid. Now nah, IUIC, I mean, I'm not trying to boast of them, but they literally run from us, like literally. Run, now we, they walk fast away from us. Let's put it that way. They almost, oh, that, that was, now that was a, uh, that was Comfy's people. Yeah. No, Comfy's people literally pilt on us. I mean, they pilt like. We got close to them, they scooped down. They be like. <laughs> it's like they was like shaking. I saw one of those little videos and I was like, man, they said, they said, I'm throwing it on the board of the combat suit. Ain't nothing like an eagle. I don't remember that. Yeah, y'all yeah. went up on that street. Y'all y'all was telling y'all wanted to go to the word of the They were away from that when they went to the car. I don't remember making fun of no way though, did we? We called the board of combat. Oh, that was probably after the, uh, because we went up being cool with him. Yeah. Man, they tried to be cool. <laughs> they tried to be cool. But you get cursed out when they try to be cool. Oh, yeah, you ain't well, you know what I mean? Back, you don't just want to go into something all crazy. Mm -hmm. You know? Right. We went to them, man, me and Deshaun, before we even got in there. Man, they thought it was crap with it. You asked them how much their little garments was. What they said, like $300. Three hundred dollars for that. They are pieces. I bet my, my garment was uh, free. My mom had a bunch <laughs> of... Uh, <laughs> She had a bunch of extra uh, fabric laying around. I just threw something together, you know? Yeah, you get fabric, uh, like Joanne fabrics, cheap as hell, whatever. Yeah, Walmart got it too. The scriptures, we got scriptures on that. It's, you know? It said that Proverbs walked around, that's a Hebrews 11. The, uh, the prophets walked around in sheepskins and goats.